From the KCHS studio at Capitol High School. This is KCHS TV. Where, where excellence, excellence happens. happens. Welcome back Eagles and good Tuesday morning. I'm David Schauver. And I'm Aaron Holt. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Today we have the latest information on upcoming events and much more. KCHS TV starts now. Club Unified is looking for partners, helpers, and athletes for basketball and track and field. For basketball, practices will be done once a week on February 4th until the tournament, which is March 9th. These practices will be during lunch for 20 to 25 minutes and no experience is necessary. Track and field will be start in April, but we will begin sign-ups so we can begin some planning meetings prior to the event, as well as practices closer to April. If you are interested in either event, please contact Mrs. Speed Jens or find a flyer around the school or sign up using the QR code. The Capitol High School Book Club is now signing up. For students and staff for our spring semester book club read, Bewilderment by Richard Powers. Once, once each, sem each semester, we read a book, periodically meet in, together in the library, during lunch for fun, thoughtful, and entertaining discussions about what we've read. As an added bonus, club members will receive a copy of that book that's theirs to keep. Sign up for the book club in the Capitol Library today. Student, open enrollment students. If you are planning to attend Capitol High School next year and live outside our boundaries, you must complete an open enrollment continuation form and have it signed by parents or guardians for the 22 or 23 school year. The form can be picked up at a counseling office or you can find one out on the Boise School District website at www.boiseschools.org under the par Parents and Patrons tab. In order to keep you are part of our capital family. We need to have a pro all the proper paperwork on file so we don't delay. Please turn in your form in the counseling office to Ms. Weems as soon as possible. Seniors, please double check your portrait and that your name is spelled correctly for the senior yearbook. Portraits will be posted outside the main office on the bulletin board outside the room of 202 all week. If you have any questions or concerns, please contact the yearbook advisor, Ms. Palmer, in room 202. There is a key club meeting today in room 249, Dr. Twist's room. Thank you. If you received an application for a National Honor Society, the deadline for submitting your forms is 3.30 p.m. on this Thursday, February 3rd. Please turn in your forms to the library or to Ms. Trennell in room 125. Late applications will not be accepted. Now on to a video for AP Capstone and a message from a couple of our students. Do you want to learn how to gather quality, peer-reviewed research that will allow you to bring your writing skills to the next level? Maybe you want to learn how to gather information on a specific trend and idea so that you can predict jumps in the stock market. Or maybe you want to learn more about a historical event. Maybe you just want to be able to take learning into your own hands by developing your own year-long project based entirely on your own interests. If any of that sounds appealing to you, the AP Capstone program may be the right program for you. In the first year of this two-year program, students are taught research skills and offered access to various databases. With an instructor's help, students are taught to gather research from various perspectives to create an orchestral final portfolio that includes two essays, a group presentation, and an individual presentation. In the second year of this class, the instructor takes a step back and students are allowed to pursue their own ideas. Students spend the year developing a research project and paper about something that they yearn to know. It is a requirement for these students to conduct some of their own research. This research can range anywhere from conducting interviews or surveys to analyzing film. As the second year comes to a close, the student will have completed their very own research paper, which is especially impressive considering they even conducted their own research. The final reward for completing this program is getting the Capstone Diploma, which can help make you stand out. If any of this sounds appealing to you, then you should give Capstone a try. 
At the very least, the skills you learn will help you in whatever you choose to do in life. Hi, I'm Kieran Willett. Seniors, are you worried about college? Well, you can gain knowledge from college students on how to navigate life independently in college and get a chance to win gift cards or certificates for free food from businesses in Boise such as Domino's, Sonic, and others. All you have to do is complete a short survey and contribute any knowledge you think would be useful for college to a website created by me, designed for this project. All, contributor, all contributions will remain anonymous. If you participate in this project, you'll have access to any results from the study and will be entered into a raffle for gift cards and certificates. If you're interested in participating, please email me at 22kieran.willett at boiseschools.net. Thank you. Hello, my name is Anna Brown and I'm enrolled in the AP Capstone program here at Capitol High. I'm in my second year of the program where I'm required to organize and execute a research project. I'm doing a comparative study on how the understanding of transgender terminology in adults in Boise, Idaho affects the acceptance of transgender identities. To test this, I will be giving out a pre and post test with a lecture about those identities um, at our school February 7th in room 204, Miss Uriades' room. If you participate, you will be entered into a raffle with gift cards and goodies. This is only for students and teachers who are 18 years or older. Please bring your own device to fill out the survey. And teachers, if you wish to participate in this in a different way, you can volunteer as a supervisor. For more information, you can contact me via email, 22anna.brown at boiseschools.net. Today in history, in 1893, Thomas Edison completes world's first movie studio at West Orange, New Jersey. Quote of the day, I said hip hop, I said hip hop, the hippie to the hippie to the hip hip hop and you don't stop, Wonder Mike. Stay safe, stay tuned and don't forget to subscribe so you never miss an update. Have an awesome day Capital, see you next time. <laughs>